So how about I do my video like this? Yeah, because I feel like my bra straps are slipping down anyways. So yeah, hi guys. Hi guys, it's Alex. And today I'm going to be doing a makeup declutter video. I don't have a lot of makeup, but I recently went through what I did have and I cleaned out just stuff that I'm not using or stuff that's expired and this is pretty much what I have in here so I want to do a makeup collection video but I don't want this you know, stuff in there so it was motivation for me to get this done. I also have my tea here that try not to spill it with my lipstick mark as well. Um, this is Thai tea. I featured this in my Asian grocery haul, so. so let's do lip products first. The first thing is a lip liner from Boutique in the color Soft Pink. I got this from Sally Beauty Supply. Sally Beauty Supply, it just has a frost finish and I found that I just wasn't grabbing it and I've just had it for way too long and, and if I'm not using it, why keep it? So yeah, that's the first one. Next one is a Mary Kay lipstick, and this is in pink satin. And the packaging is really pretty. It has a silver, I don't know what that is, with the Mary Kay uh, signature on it. And again, it's a bit of a like satin, frosty finish. I just have this for way too long, and I don't wear it, so... Yeah, I figured I would go ahead and take that out. The next thing is a NYX Mega Shine lip gloss, and it's in Nude Peach. One thing about these, though, they do smell good. Oh, they smell really good, and when they're on their lips, it's not that you're eating it, but you can taste it, and the taste is nice. It doesn't have, like, a nasty taste to it, but I just found this too bright. It just doesn't match very well. This is a nice shade. Um, I don't even know who it's from because the writing has rubbed off, but it's a nice deep red rich color. I wore this a few times, but I don't wear red a whole lot, but I just had this, yeah, too long and I'm, I'm not wearing it anymore. Um, I tried this e.l.f. lip stain. Um, here's a stain and then here's a gloss in the color Mysterious. And this just had no color payoff whatsoever, so I just didn't even grab it or reach for it anymore. It was just a waste of time. I just kept applying, 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 until finally I just wasn't reaching for it anymore, and it's just sitting there. So, yeah, that's gotta go. The next thing, I think the writing's rubbed off. I think this is Cover Girl. I got this at Big Lots as well, and it is in Shimmer shimmer Shell. It's a nice, frosty, clear lip gloss, um, but I don't wear it outdated. So, yeah, I don't want to be repetitive by saying outdated, but yeah, that's the main reason. Um, next thing is an e.l.f. matte lip color. It looks pretty. It's like a pretty nude color but on me it's too nude it's like white beige nude on my lips and it looks horrible on me and this is in the color nearly nude I look like a freak with it on I'll try and insert a clip of me wearing it just so you know what I'm talking about next thing is one another one of those NYX lip glosses mega shine lip gloss and this is in sugar pie and it's a light pink frosty color. They're only good for six months, it says. So yeah, I guess it would be expired because I've had these a couple of years. The NARS, this is one of those freebies that you get on your birthday if you're signed up with Sephora. Um, this color just does not look right on me. So yeah, that had to go. And this is in Rukujian. The next thing is the Revlon Color Stay Lip Liner. The application on this was so horrible did not go on smoothly. It's one of the twist ups. It's actually even broken. I had to put the stick back in there, as you can see. Just awful. It was patchy. 
did not work very well on me. I don't know if it's just this color, this whatever, but yeah, I hated it. So that's gotta go. So moving on to eyes, I have a NYX cream shadow. I just thought this was really pretty. It, once you put it on, it stayed on. Um, I had this for such a long time since I started my lipstick baby doll channel probably, but I only used it a few times. It's kind of goopy and dried out and clumpy right now. The Maybelline Lash Sensational. I pretty much use all of this up and um, yeah. I know this is pretty popular, but for me, it just, I don't know. I didn't really like it. I didn't really like the effect that it gives on my lashes. My lashes are really, like, lay really weird, and it's really hard to find a mascara that separates and kind of curls them at the same time. And the next thing is the Maybelline Rocket Mascara. I probably like this one better than the last one. Um... I don't know, I just, it defined my lashes a little bit better, and yeah, I pretty much used all of this, it just the fact that it's expired, so yeah, that's gotta go, and there's very little product of it left. The next thing is a CoverGirl Intense Shadow Blast Primer and Shadow in One, and I use this quite a bit, I didn't use it as... A primer and eyeshadow I just use it as a primer I'd always, I would always apply eyeshadow over it um, it applied kind of patchy for me but I did use quite a bit of it not all of it but yeah and then the last eye product is this Avon eyeshadow I've pulled this out to try and use it several times and I just don't. I just don't reach for it, and I don't think I'm going to be reaching for this. It's Heavenly Soft Green Envy Trio. They're really pretty colors, but yeah, I'm just not using it. Revlon Color Stay Mineral, Mineral, Mineral Mousse. Why can't I say that? Um, it's very oily. You gotta really shake it. If you don't shake it when you open it, a bunch of oil will come out. This lasts for. 24 months it says on the back and I've had it for way longer than that so yeah that's going in the bin I'm getting rid of this Rimmel Clean Finish Matte Foundation in Soft Beige I use this quite a bit there's probably half of it full but it's just an okay foundation to me um, the applicator is pretty interesting. I like that there was an applicator. Sometimes it's just a bottle and a cap, and that's all you get. I have one of those Dream Match Lumi um, concealers. This worked really nice. I pretty much used all of it up, as you can hopefully see. But um, yeah, so I guess that was everything. That was everything I pulled from my makeup drawer. So it's a little more neater now, and I kind of want to rearrange. Um, my setup a bit just give a little update and perk it up so this is all the makeup I'm tossing if you enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button if you would like to see more videos don't know what I'm doing here thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video bye guys